there it is. It just arrived today. Now we get to open it. Okay, so I have very carefully cut it open, and we are going to open this box for the very, very first time. With one hand holding the top. Ridgewood Watch Company. My new favorite watch company. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. box. Zero, zero, number 462. Right, be careful with these instructions. Would you look at that? United States Police Force. Wow. Also comes with two chargers. <coughs> is obviously pretty awesome magnetic front and all one day I will have a gold fire edition look at that that is amazing United States Police Force logo on the back I got the buckled version because I will be wearing it so often I outlast any Velcro. That is it. Ridgewood Watch Company makes these and they are just incredible. So what we're going to do here is get this bad boy charged up and check it out. Here you got the inside the box. Name S.D. Bob Snake Pliskin. Branch, U.S. Army, rank, Lieutenant. Unit, Special Forces, and Blacklight. Commendations, Purple Heart, Leningrad, Purple Heart, Siberia, and Distinguished Service Cross. His discharge was honorable. His criminal conviction was armed robbery of Federal Reserve Depository. Sentence location. New York Maximum Security Penitentiary. Sentence life in prison. I guess I go in one way or another. This is badass. Badass. Okay, so I've been playing with this for a bit. <clears throat> There's the time. Double click that bad boy. Whoops, the second time. Is the countdown timer I started just to see what happens. Uh, I do not know yet how to stop it and start over. <coughs> There's the clock again up there. You got the date. Um, 
There's the timer. I mean stopwatch. Another thing that I uh, have yet to figure out how to just set back to zero. Um, overall, this thing is just absolutely amazing. I love it so far. Uh, let's see here. Yep, I used uh, I used the alarm four times today during our barbecue. Battery at ninety seven percent. That is concerning me right now. Um, I gotta give it. I gotta give it time still, but when I charged it up, it charged pretty fast until it hit 97% and then it just stayed there for what seemed like ever. I mean I was thinking at the time that maybe the top 3% were where most of the battery was, you know, so. Uh, but I've been playing with it for a while now and when I first charged it to like 85% and I started using it, I could literally watch the battery go down like, you know, a point a minute. So, after charging to 97%, and been using it for quite a while, I'm confused as to why it still says 97%. So I'm going to keep an eye on that, plus um, I will turn it off and then back on, <clears throat> plus I'll let it charge all night just to see if it, that last 3% is... I don't know. That was something to do with it. Anyway, uh, things really cool. Uh, fits well, feels well. You can tell it has weight to it, but it's not too incredibly heavy. It's, uh, you know, it just feels like a, like you're wearing a, a damn good watch. Um, yeah, so there's a world clock, which I just actually have set to the same as the standard clock. It's just specific time. Uh, there's your camera thing. You can access your camera shutter, which I have yet to play with. But there are some cool features on this thing. Like I went in um, to the app on my phone. I got an iPhone. <clears throat> and you can adjust a few of the things like for instance this will stay on the screen the screen will stay lit up for 10 seconds that's the max um, that's what I, I put it on was the full 10 seconds um, you can set your notifications um, like when you get a text it'll say the person's name will come across and it will uh, have a little dash and then we'll read the message or at least part of it uh, another thing I need to check out is how long of a message it will actually show you, or if it will just preview uh, like basically your iPhone does, you know, gives you a, a short portion of it on your screen, but you have to click on the actual actual message to get the, uh, the full message. So uh, I have yet to experiment with that. I will be doing that. Um, let's see, yeah, in, went in, played around in the settings a bit. Uh, dialed things in. Uh, you can go into your uh, your notifications. You can get notifications from Facebook, uh, Instagram, uh, Twitter, and a few other social media sites. Uh, I was a little surprised that uh, YouTube is not in there yet. Hopefully that is something they will add in there uh, for notifications at some point later. Anyway, um, yeah, I couldn't be happier. This thing's fantastic. Fun as hell. Looks cool as hell. And if you're a huge Escape from New York fan like me, then you can appreciate this thing. Well, I'm going to continue to play with this thing and I will give you updates as it goes uh, 
I'll probably post another video in 16 hours, 44 minutes, and 11 seconds. When I very, very first turned it on across the stream, screen, it said welcome and then said my full name and everything to Life Clock One. Um, I don't know if that will appear after I shut it down and each time I restart it or if that was um, one shebang there in the, you know, right in the beginning. Uh, another thing I did play with was uh, movie mode, um, and you can get basically movie quotes, quotes, quotes from Escape from New York across the screen. Um, you know, you can set it to every hour, every two hours, once a day. Um, pretty interesting. Um, or you can just say no thanks on that for now. Yeah, this is this is everything I could have really actually hoped for. I mean, uh, so far so good. <laughs> 